Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last week, as I posted, NVIDIA rolled out their latest GeForce Game Ready driver, version 531.18. And as I mentioned in that video, which I'll leave a link to in the description, this latest driver brought and included support for the new RTX video super resolution support uh, in the Google Chrome web browser and a lot more. But unfortunately, although it did include support for RTX video super resolution, um, unfortunately, the driver is causing issues. And um, there is a bug which um, has been reported by numerous users now, where they are noticing a slightly higher CPU usage after installing the latest driver version 531.18. So if you are seeing an increased CPU usage, then you are not alone. Now, um, NVIDIA has identified this as a known issue and as a bug which they have confirmed, but unfortunately at this stage, NVIDIA hasn't rolled out a fix. And um, seems to be a bug at this stage with the latest drivers that is caused by that latest driver, as mentioned, where the NVIDIA container uses approximately 10% more uh, CPU uh, usage after logon or after closing um, certain games. So... Um, this has been noticed in the task manager by a whole lot of users where if you just head to your performance, you click on CPU, they have noticed after installing that latest driver that there is a slight increase of about 10% or more CPU after logging in or after closing games. Now, um, as mentioned, NVIDIA hasn't rolled out a fix, so you're not going to get any driver update as yet, and we do hope that they roll out a fix sooner than later. But until they do roll out a fix, um, what you can do is you can try roll back uh, to the previous driver that will obviously fix the issue, but obviously then you will lose um, support for the RTX video super resolution support uh, in the Google Chrome web browser and wherever else it is used. And uh, um, to roll back a driver, um, just to do a quick recap, as I have posted a whole video on, on how to do that, and you can just do a search on the channel, but just a quick recap. On Windows, if you just right click on your start menu, Click on Device Manager, and you just look for your display adapters. Now, I don't have an NVIDIA GPU, so but I'm sure that by the end of the video, though, you'll get the general idea. And you just double-click on your driver, head up to the tab that says Driver, and here you'll see a tab called Rollback Driver. You click on that, and follow the steps, and that will roll you back to the previous driver, which should solve those issues. But as mentioned, um, until NVIDIA does roll out a fix, which we hope is sooner than later, you will lose um, support for uh, uh, um, NVIDIA's super resolution. Now, as you can see in my case, rollback driver is blanked out and grayed out. So if you cannot roll back your driver and that option is grayed out, it means you have uninstalled the driver package using another cleanup method. So unfortunately, if you have uninstalled your driver package, you won't be able to roll back. But if you haven't, you'll see this tab, click on it, roll back driver, follow the steps, and that will roll you back to the previous version. But um, if anything does change and NVIDIA does roll out a fix, I will obviously post and let you know accordingly. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.